Hey everyone, this is Prince Watercrest, and welcome back to Let's Play Bravo Man. I believe we are on stage six. And we got some new enemies here, including, well, I guess that's more of an old enemy than a new one, but I'd rather not take chances that I'd not, rather not even, you know, underestimate them in any way. There is a new enemy here that we'll be seeing shortly. It's some weird thing that basically has like an orange balloon that actually that actually is a bomb. I'm trying to say what the enemy is as I try to concentrate really hard on making my way up here. I do want to make my way up here because ramen! That gives us more health than the rice ball ever will and there's that thing. When you hit that orange balloon monster, I guess you can call it that. It kind of deflates and you have a ch and you have like a limited amount of time to hit it. Ow. Before before it blows itself back up and starts going it back into the air and shooting bombs. Hey. An atom power up. I'll take it. This thing lets you shoot little fireball projectiles. And I'm trying to do a super jump and I'm failing poorly, but I do like the fact that you can get a few ow, a few hits, or rather do a lot more damage, do some more hits worth of damage with the fireball than you could your usual punch attack. And at this rate, can I go back? I can, good. I do want to go back. Oh, I'd eventually be going up here anyway. Okay. Well, let me kick this thing with up and two there. Let's avoid the fireball. This is what I was thinking of. The part where, this is the part where I had to go up that I was thinking of. And I wanna get this and that. This and the next two stages are quite possibly my best chance at getting health and I don't want to ruin it. And here we face, oh. Attack when he lets his shield down. I was about ready to spoil that. This is where he faces Zoltan, the right-hand man of Dr. Bomb. We can hit him at least once, and then we gotta get away from him and his fireballs. Now he starts shooting the shield. You want to avoid the fireballs. And eventually... We're going to have to get in super close when he moves his shield back. And just do up and two to just keep kicking him while he has his shield back like that. Shield back, kick. Just like that. He's a lot easier than you would think. And I got seven whole symbols. That's really good. Yes, random Nippon flag belly wheel guy. I really do like to eat. I really would. I also noticed you have tricycle or unicycle pedals too. I've never noticed that until now. Anyway, Dr. Bomb basically hints that the next stage takes place underwater. So we might as well just go ahead and get into a shooting frenzy here. And I have a lot of health. I really need to think and concentrate and stuff. Ow. And I also need to make sure that I don't get hit at any point because any, if I lose any health in this stage, I won't be able to get it back in this stage either. And you are there. I also need to watch out for the enemies that come out from above. And there's going to be another enemy right here. I want to shoot him down as quickly as possible. I want to be very careful. And one there and one there too. You're over there. You're going to show up in the Flying V formation, so I'm going to have to destroy as many of you as possible. And there is a jellyfish there. 
And there's another two of you there. Thankfully, I saw him coming a mile away. You do not want these jellyfish tile enemies touching you because if they do, they will latch on and unless you press the one button to bomb it, it'll just keep sapping away at your health and that's no fun for anyone. Let's get out of here. Let's stay away from you. I have plenty of health. This is really, really good. I am the overlord of Atlantis. I have four guys who circle around me. They shoot projectiles while I shoot projectiles. Hope you can avoid them all. Wow, I had to get one hit by one eventually there, I would imagine. One of the best things you can do is focus on one of them while after avoiding a slew of projectiles and I made this look super easy. Once you destroy at least one of these guys, you make this a lot easier. Also, my lovely followers. Gotta love that English. Also, that rock formation or what looks like a lock for rock formation looked like the Loch Ness Monster. And Pistol Lord. We're gonna face him in stage eight. This will be the last stage that I do in this video. Because it's the last one I practice. And we got plenty of new enemies here. We got a flying bird guy. I want to grab some things. And I do want to go up here as well. Besides points, we do want to watch out for the bombs. And we do want to go over here for some points and two rice balls. And we want to watch out for these guys that are in the baskets as well. If you hit them, they t basically plead with you to leave them alone. Um, there's a bird guy up there. And I'm probably going to run into him. I thought so. I didn't want that, unfortunately, but, well, here we are. And there are plenty of snake enemies here, too. Whoa! I was trying to avoid that guy, and it didn't happen. And I'm going to have to go back up eventually. Because if I keep keep at it at the lower levels, I'm going to reach a dead end eventually. And I need you... Hi, Random Bat. How's it going? I need, Yeah, I'm about to say, I need him to come down there. And I forgot that door was going to open. You know what? That's okay. Can you get away from me? Thank you. Now, yeah, I would have to go over there. And we will have to avoid bombs. And spikes. Ow. These guys do not want. I'm going to wait for you to come back up, and then boom, I'm going to run. All right. And now it's time for Pistol Lord. Oh, sorry. Pistol Load. We're going to have to keep attacking this guy and his missiles. Duck under them when necessary. Destroy the fans as he flies back and forth here. And when he says, you win, don't hurt me, he's lying. He's lying faster than you can say Henry Rollins. Or Seth Rollins. Mr. Money in the Bank Rollins was the best. And yep, he's lying again. Because he's a liar. He'll burn your soul. Same strategies as the first time and the second time. And when he says that, you've beaten him. Let's go ahead and get some symbol action here and then boom we can eat some food this went exactly like I want it I am glad my hairstyle is modern also you don't say and I just hit 10 minutes but you know what I'll take it Join me next time, where we go through three or four more stages, 
and try to keep her health as high as possible. Because I finally got my health where I want it. I don't want to mess this up. I really don't want to mess this up. Until then, this is Prince Watercrest. Take care, stay safe, and thanks for watching!